Hello, everyone. I'm Chris Bowley, Customer and Brand Marketing Manager for New Farm. Thank you for taking the time to view this webinar, one of several episodes in New Farm's virtual learning webinar series. Today, we're going to review the role that plant growth regulators play in growing a profitable cotton crop. I'd like to introduce you to Bill McBright, New Farm Territory Manager for the Delta Growing Region. Thanks, Chris. As Chris said, I'm going to spend some time over the next 10 to 15 minutes talking about cotton plant growth regulators, or PGRs. Having grown up and worked in the Delta region of the country, I understand how important cotton is to the agricultural economy, so I'm pleased to be talking about the role that PGRs play in growing a high-yielding and high-quality crop. I'm going to cover the following topics, a general description and explanation of what PGRs are required, typical timing windows for PGRs and harvest aids, I'll review the three phases of PGR applications, mid-season, late-season, and harvest aids and defoliants. And finally, I'll spend a few minutes introducing or reintroducing you to some brands that make up New Farms, Cotton, PGR, and Harvest Aid portfolio. So why are PGRs a necessary part of growing a successful, high-quality, and profitable crop? Cotton is actually a perennial plant that we grow as an annual crop. If cotton is allowed to grow without any growth regulators, it will still produce bowls, but the bowl growth will be erratic and bowl formation will be inconsistent, developing at different rates across a field based on local environmental conditions. The plant would also expend excess energy on vegetative growth rather than reproductive development, resulting in very tall, very wide green plants and decreasing the number of bowls formed and quality of the resulting fiber. The end result would be an almost unharvestable field low yields and staggered harvesting times because the plant maturity dates in a field would not be synchronized. The first step in PGR application involves mid-season products. Almost all mid-season PGRs work by inhibiting gibberellin, a hormone that stimulates cell growth, leading to stem elongation and leaf enlargement. Mid-season PGRs need to be applied at the time window between match head square and early bloom. Application rates will depend on the rate of growth or vegetative vigor and canopy density of the plant. Inhibiting gibberellin production in the plant does a couple of things. First, it slows down the cell expansion, introducing general plant growth. It also regulates the growth of all plants treated in an area, ensuring a common, consistent growth rate across your field. Second, and equally as important, the plant responds to PGR uptake by changing its metabolism and focusing less energy on vegetative growth and more towards reproductive growth, leading to more bowl formation and higher fiber content. Later in the growth of a cotton plant, we move to the time when the targeted processes in the plant move from controlling vegetative growth to focus on bowl opening and then preparing the crop for harvesting. There are three categories of late season PGRs, bowl openers, defoliants, and desiccants. Bowl openers use hormonal action to stimulate the production of ethylene in a plant, optimizing the ripening process. The use of bowl openers helps to ensure the bowls within a field open at approximately the same time, which in turn allows for synchronized bowl production and harvest timing. The most widely used active ingredient is ethophon, which is found in brands such as Super Bowl, Terminate, and Cotton Quick. Defoliants, as the name implies, are applied to defoliate the plant, reducing the leaf material that can contaminate land at harvest time. Defoliants tend to contain hormones, herbicides, or combination of these two modes of actions. It's normal to start applying defoliants after bowl maturation has commenced, when anywhere between 40% and 80% of the bowls have reached maturity. Other gauges of when to apply include counting nodes above crack bowls or tracking growing degree days. Thidazeron, commonly referred to as TDZ, is commonly found in commercial defoliant brands including Freefall SC and Cutout. Very similar to the defoliants, we have a group of chemicals that are referred to as desiccants. Desiccants tend to be herbicides whose primary mode of action is to kill off the plant foliage, which then dries out or desiccates prior to dropping from the plant. Desiccants generally act faster than hormonal defoliants, killing and drying out leaves in one to several days as opposed to multiple days or weeks. There are many herbicides that are registered as cotton desiccants, including carfentrazone, the active ingredient found in Longbow EC, Paraquat, and pyroflufen. As I mentioned before, the timing of application of cotton PGRs and harvest aids can vary greatly depending on a variety of environmental conditions. In many ways, effective use of these compounds is more of an art than a science and relies heavily on past experience, trial, and error. The best way to manage your crop is to depend on the lessons you've learned over time or consultation with local experts such as state extension cotton specialists, manufacturers, technical reps, or your peers, other cotton growers who have had years of growing cotton in the conditions common to your part of the world. Now that I have your attention, I'd like to spend just a few minutes describing the products that New Farm has in our cotton product portfolio. 
We are proud to be serving the American cotton grower with one of the broadest portfolios available in the agricultural chemical business. To start off, I'll mention Pentia. In 2021, New Farm acquired the Pentia brand and assets from BASF and are now the sole registrant and manufacturer of this popular product. Pentia is an enhanced mefaquat PGR based on a unique pentaborate salt. Pentia's increased efficacy in modulating plant growth has been recognized for over 15 years, and the secret comes in the patented electrodialysis manufacturing method that results in a chemical bonding of the mepiquat and pentaboric components, providing superior uptake of both chemistries by the plant versus when they are applied separately in mixtures. As you can see on this slide, Pentia has multiple performance benefits compared to competing products. Pentia exhibits all the characteristics required of an early to mid-season PGR with the added advantages of superior rain fastness. It's rain safe in two hours or one hour when mixed with a sticker or adjuvant. and has provided proven data to support claims of better fruit retention and improved yields. If you're looking for a cost-effective mepiquat chloride product, New Farm manufactures Mepex. The mepiquat chloride molecule in the form of a quaternary ammonium salt found in MEPEX provides a crop with excellent bowl retention potential and helps to manage short season production, compressing the growth cycle leading up to bowl production and then harvest. Mepiquat chloride on its own will help to modulate vegetative growth and enhanced Mepiquat products, although a little more expensive, have been shown to provide even better results. GenOut is an enhanced Mepiquat chloride product with the enhancement coming from the addition of the cytokine and chemical Conetin. The Kinetin in this mixture provides additional leaf expansion stimulation, enhances bud formation, and delays leaf senescence or natural aging. This allows leaves to remain packed with optimal chlorophyll levels for an extended period, optimizing the normal metabolic processes needed for a healthy growing plant. When you want the security of a high quality Ethafine product, look no further than Super Bowl, one of the best known and trusted names in the Ethafine business. As described earlier, Ethafine plays an important role in promoting bowl opening and enables growers to harvest earlier, gaining increased yields, and for decades, Super Bowl has been the go-to brand of Ethafon across the U.S. cotton belt. Cotton Quick is a unique premix containing Ethafon and urea sulfate, which has been proven to act as a synergist to enhance Ethafon activity, and is designed for use when conditions are a little cooler and the enhancement is required to help with uptake by a slower metabolizing plant. So when your crop requires a boost to open up slower maturing bowls, Cotton Quick is the answer. When applied a little later in the season, Cotton Quick can also be tank mixed with TDZ at a slightly reduced rate to improve defoliation consistency and speeding up leaf drop, which is a convenient segue into harvest aids. Terminate contains a combination of ethafon and cyclanolid, an oxentite growth regulator that helps to inhibit terminal leaf growth and regrowth. Terminate has been proven to promote both bowl opening and fast leaf drop and in certain conditions can accelerate the defoliation process, meaning an earlier opportunity to harvest, which is of great value if there's a risk of bad weather in the short to midterm forecast. One of the best known brands of Thidazuron or TDZ in the business is Freefall SC. Growers have placed their trust in Freefall for a long time and no wonder with its excellent reputation for quality and reliability. Freefall SC provides the double benefit of, of providing top performing defoliation while also inhibiting regrowth leading up to harvest time, meaning less chance of leaves resprouting and causing sticky cotton should weather delay harvesting activities. Another product to consider if cooler weather is in the forecast prior to harvest is Cutout. Cutout is a premix containing TDZ and diuron, and with low use rates, it is an excellent and economical tank mix partner for bowl opening PGRs such as Ethafon found in Super Bowl. Moving now away from the PGR arena and into the herbicidal desiccation world, this slide in introduces you to Longbow EC. Launched in 2021, Longbow EC is one of the most recent additions to the New Farm cotton portfolio. The active ingredient, Carfentrazone, is the same active found in AIM EC and performs as a fast-acting defoliant at very low use rates. Longbow EC also provides the added benefit of being an excellent broadleaf weed killer, knocking down weeds that may be present at harvesting time and adding another layer of insurance against lint being contaminated with plant material. Longbow EC is a highly compatible tank mix partner with a wide range of PGRs and other desiccants and defoliants, providing multiple benefits as described on this slide. Thank you, Bill. And thank you all for taking the time to watch and listen. That wraps up this episode of New Farms Virtual Learning Webinar Series. 
If you'd like to learn more about New Farm's cotton protection portfolio, please visit our website at www.newfarm.com backslash US crop backslash cotton solutions and download a copy of our cotton solutions guide. If you've enjoyed this webinar and would like to view more in the virtual webinar series, we encourage you to visit our website, newfarm.com backslash US crop and click on the resources tab.